Mostly. to uh, 7G. I'll be following you, but up the back way. Luke, I want you to take Eric, and what is your name again, son? Mills. Take Eric and Mills and go down to the south side. Luke? Yeah, boss. Be careful out there. Those damn bloody protesters have been getting too close lately. Okay. Time's a waste. The size of this second growth. Yeah. Hey, get the hell down here now! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, hey! If I have to tell you boys to stay out of my field one more time, heads are gonna roll. You understand that? Okay, relax, Chester. We're just doing our jobs out here. It's Matt. And when your job is interfering with my job, we got a problem. What problem? I don't have a problem. Who's got a problem? 
Just tell your boys to be careful, okay? I don't see anybody getting hurt. We'll do that. And thanks for the heads up, you know? I really appreciate the way you look out for us. I really do. I mean that. Thank you, Mick. Mac. What? Mac. Walter! Just in the... Okay. Okay, boys, let's talk and more chop. Carter, I think you might want to check this out. Something isn't right. I've never seen this volume of sap before. Where is this from? Number four. Just now? Just a second. Well, we'll keep our eyes on it. There's no cause for alarm. And now, turning to page six of your reports, you'll see that since implementing GX 1134, our projected profit margin after this first harvest will show us an increase of 15%. Sorry. Nice of you to join us.
Next quarter, with testing area expansion into the east, west, and eventually south sections, we'll be looking at 18, 24, and 32% increases, respectively. And sir, I don't need to tell you what this will mean to our bottom line. Her name is Rita Hoffman. She heads up an environmental group called the Forest Action Committee. For the past year, she's been something of a thorn in our side. Uh, protests, roadblocks, tree spiking, rallies. Remember this one a couple of years ago? This guy? I thought we had him put in jail. Oh, we did, but Rita Hoffman was his right-hand girl. Why do I have to know this? If she's been on us for a whole year, we've been handling it, right? Well, sir, we've lost contact with one of our logging camps on the island, and it's one of the camps that's been a main target for Hoffman and our crew. But what really concerns me is this particular camp is in one of our testing areas. Now, if Hoffman and her crew found out what we were doing, it could draw unnecessary attention to the GX program. What's your next shot? I don't know, Dad. I'll see where it lands. Tyler, you make this shot, you're going to end up right here with nothing. Now, give me three other shots. Green in the corner. You'll never make that one. What else? All right, look, look, look. There's nothing wrong with getting out there and getting your hands dirty. I started out in the field and I built my way up. It's exactly what you need. I don't think you know what I need. I got a half a dozen people trying to tell me that I need to send in somebody experienced. But I want you to go. Yeah, I made my first landing today. I'm glad I didn't run over the water. I hit it perfectly. Very first time Randy said I was a natural. That's very nice. But if you could just look at the bigger picture for one minute, all right? I'm asking for your help. You've seen the boardroom. You need to get out there and learn the business from the ground up if you're going to take over one day. Dad, I don't know anything about being in the field, your test areas and all of this stuff. It's way over my head. And you know what? I don't care about that stuff. Well, God damn it, maybe it's about time you started to care. 30 years. I have invested 30 years of my life in this company. You think I busted my ass all those years so I could sit back now and watch you piss it all away? I need to know that I could throw you into something and that you'll be able to handle it. You're shot.
Hello! Hey man, what's going on here? Where's everybody? Not much further, all right? Uh, Are you okay? I don't know. Okay. We're gonna have to pick up the base. Okay, come on. Get away! 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 Get away!
can't keep letting everybody in Try like this. Try something like that again. I'm going to personally put you out there. Understand that? You cannot keep letting people in like this. Everybody that comes to the damn door, how do we know he's not one of them? Because he's being attacked by one of them, that's how. They don't go after each other, that much we know. You said that yourself, you son of a bitch. Are you gonna just lead everybody here yeah. and then everyone can just start peeling away? Because that's what they'll do. Shh, keep they'll your peel voice away down. at this place. Keep your voice down. Shut they'll him tear up. Tear the entire thing apart. Shut apart. up! You know that? Okay, how many are out there, man? There's a lot of familiar faces out there, boss. Okay, you know what? Okay, everyone needs to listen to me, okay? When you start making sense, we're gonna start listening. You have no idea what's out there. Hey, I still have people out there. You still have people out there. Well, if you still have people out there, maybe you should go out there and find them. You people are sabotaging my operation out there. You're putting my men's life at risk. I have no responsibility to your people to help you out of any of this. You understand that? For all I know, this is some hippie crusader stunt you people this are pulling. This is a stunt? There are people dying out there. The only reason I'm out here is because I give a shit about the environment. The one that you and your people are raping! Could somebody please just tell me what's going on? Who the hell is he? I don't know. I just found him out there. Maybe if you paid a little bit more attention, you'd recognize your boss's son when you see him. You? What the hell are you doing out here, son? I just came out to see why production stopped. Production? Not to see if we were okay because you haven't you heard from us? Mac? Why don't you well, leave me bully. alone? No, you're huh? being a bully. You know what? Why don't you leave me alone? I think that's a real good idea. What do you think about that? So, what did the smooth endoplasmic reticulum say to the rough endoplasmic reticulum? Is that a ribosome on you? Or are you just excited to see me? Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, son of a... Oh. You all right? You know, yeah, it's just, it's just a little cut, I think. No, I don't know, that looks pretty bad. I'll go get something. Tom. Hey, you all right? Tom? Tom! Holy shit! Whoa, whoa, hey! Tom! I don't care about likelihood. He's in there. I want him out. Sir, you understand what a potential PR disaster this could be. Our stock values will... Don't you talk to me about stock values when my son is in danger. You have every right to be upset. I understand how you must feel. You don't understand a goddamn thing. You have to sign these orders, sir. I've been instructed by the board to proceed with the containment. I'm the chairman of the board. If you don't sign these orders, we'll be forced to take a vote, and I can assure you the board will vote unanimously in favor of 
the containment procedures. We're gonna get out of here, that's all I know. I'm not leaving this cabin. You had a better suggestion? Yeah, I have a better suggestion. We wait in here where it's safe until someone comes to rescue us. That's not gonna stop them. We have to get out of here now. You wanna stay here, you stay here. Okay, fine, fine. Let's put it to a vote. Who wants to stay in here? Uh, I'm with Rita, I, I, I believe that we should stay uh, right here. I got, a, I got a truck. Where's your truck, son? I got a truck by the mill. Where's the mill? Okay, the mill's not too far from here. So like, how far minutes. is not too far? I said about 15 minutes. All right, fine, let's go. I'm not staying here with Carter. Because I said we should stay, now you're gonna go? So, wait, wait, wait. okay, so okay. everybody's going? I'm not staying in here with you. Okay, quiet. Wait for me out there, I'll be right there. Luke, why don't you bring up the rear? Still there. I have to go back to get him. I do not think that we should do that, okay? Please, I do not think that we should be heroes. You wanted to go to the truck. We should keep going to the truck. Boss. Mac? What? We could chase them for hours. I think we could do more good if we get to that truck. Here. Huh? Okay. Come on. Ah! <laughs> 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 
Just another 200 miles to the nearest town. Another four miles to the police station. Police station? Yeah. What the hell are you gonna do? Arrest those things? Got a better idea? If you're going to the police station, drop us off before we get there. Any trouble? Actually, I'd rather just avoid having any unnecessary encounters, thanks. Damn, kids should be arrested. That is a typical righteous capitalist attitude. Whoa, whoa, ease up, okay? Have some respect. This is insane. Who in the hell could have done this? I don't believe this. They're trying to lock us in. Yeah, that, that, that'd be my guess. They're, uh, they're locking us in. We'll climb it. We'll go on foot. It's 200 miles. We'll never make it without a truck. Nobody's coming. Nobody's coming for us. Don't you understand? They don't care about us. Nobody cares about us. If they have to risk a handful of a, of a bunch of people to keep their secret from getting up, they'll do it. The communications room at the mill. There's a radio in there. Come on, let's go. I'm not going back there. Then you stay here. Okay, when we get to the mill, we're gonna have to secure the gate, make sure none of those things are in the yard. I'm gonna make my way to the comm room and see what I can do. Look out!
Come on, guys. Let's go. Okay, keep going. You two, go around and hit to the side, go in the back, lock the gate, and we'll come up later. Carter, get back here, damn it. Now, come here. Okay, what I want you to do is get their attention. Wait till they come into the building. I'll tell you when, okay? Wait, 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 what the hell are you gonna do? Don't worry about me. I can make better time without worrying about you two. Just get him in the clearing. Okay. Carter. See you later. Fine, and we're gonna get out of here really soon, right? Hello? 
Hello? Oh, God, Carter. You all right? Yeah, you know, I'm fine. Are you sure? You don't look all right. Where's Mac? Mac is still out there. He's making his way in, and Luke, uh, Luke was with him. I don't know where he is. We all here? Except for Luke. Greg's in the back with Stacy. He's hurt pretty bad. Well, what happened to Luke? I don't know. He, he, he was there, and then he wasn't there, and then I, I don't know what happened. Didn't you see? We, 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 we came to the door together. At least I, I, I thought he was with me, and then he, 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 he wasn't there. I couldn't do anything. I mean, I... Is anybody out there? Can anybody hear me? Can anybody hear me? Come in. There's no way to prepare for something like that. He wasn't human anymore. You know, and it was you or him. That's the only way you can look at it. Yeah. Let's just secure the gate. Can anybody hear me? Is anybody out there? Come in, come in. Is anybody out there? Who is this? Can you hear? Ah, shit. I can't hear you. What the hell are you doing lurking around out there with that damn thing in your hand? Protection? You know, you're never gonna get that piece of junk working, Mac. Look, if you're not gonna help, get the hell out of here. You start to work on my last damn nerve. Always a pleasure, Mac. Jackass. Where's Greg? Where's Stacy? Hey, guys. Greg? Stacy? Hey. Hey. Can anybody hear me? Come in. Damn it! 
Come on. Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god, Tyler! <laughs> Come on. I thought I told you to get the hell out of It's the only way to keep them from coming back. I have no idea. You know something, goddammit! And I want some answers! Now! Mac, I work at the company, like you. I'm just out here doing my job, that's it. Just like you. It's called GX 1134. It's a genetically enhanced hormone we injected into the fungus at the base of the tree. It, 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 it brings in the nutrients and multiplies them. You get old growth trees in a third of the time. I don't buy it. Genetically mutated trees? What the hell are we talking about? The Twilight Zone here or something? No. Ask him. Well? Yeah, GX, I'll, whatever. I'm, it sounds familiar, but I don't. I don't know what it is. Well, I do. It's my job. I work at the company. I come out here. I collect samples. I send them back to the lab, and they test them for the progress. There were some inconsistencies with the samples, and, 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 and the, the guys at the lab they didn't want to hear about it. They told me to stay quiet. And, and what could I do? So how did it do all this? My best guess is the guy, your meal, at, uh, his name was Eric. He's the host. The sap from his saw must have gotten into his bloodstream and then... I can't believe you, Carter. I can't believe you'd just do anything for a few extra bucks. Like, look what you've done. You think you're saving the forests? Chaining yourself to trees, waving around little flags? accomplishes nothing. I am the only one who is trying to make a difference. I am the only one that can actually end clear-cut logging. You can't do it like this. Not my fault. safe out there. You should come inside. I'm not leaving him out here. You two go back inside. I can take care of myself. Don't worry about me. Fine.
like my son. You know, I have three girls at home who I love more than life itself. But I always wanted boys. That's why out here, you see, they're my boys. And I take good care of them. I look out after them, always taking good care of them. And I've lost them all. And there's nothing I can do. Bridge locked out. The only other way out of here is the back road up through the other camp. How far? 20, 25 miles. What? It's got ham in it. I'll have it. Are you Jewish? No, I'm vegan. You know what? I think there's some tomatoes. They're a little mushy, but I think they're good. Thanks. I think this is a good place to bed down. Seems pretty safe around here. We'll get a fresh start in the morning. Never gonna start. All right, come on again, again. Give us some gas. We are stuck here. We are never getting out, and this piece of crap is never gonna start. Come on, one more time. Struck down by the road there. Come on, Rita, get in.
Hold up. do now. The camp is just up over there, about three miles or so, just over that crest. Are you sure? I know these woods like the back of my hand, young lady. Yeah, I'm sure. Well, maybe there's another road. Maybe, 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 maybe we're lost. There is no other road, Carter. We cannot take the truck. We must go on foot.
probably don't remember me, huh? Andy. Oh, good memory. What was that, eight years ago? Yeah, about that. Anderson. Tyler. Yeah, I know who you are. That's uh, Rita and Carter. Carter. A long time no see. You know this guy? Oh, we know Carter all right. Don't we, Carter? What, you slink back here to see some old friends? Well, we sure missed you. You see, Carter here... Well, Carter's real popular with some of the boys, aren't you, Carter? You know, as a matter of fact, when this whole mess started, they were asking about you. Isn't that right, Jack? What were you doing in the woods, Carter? Yeah, what were you doing? What are you doing? What, 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 same thing that you guys are doing in the woods. I, I, I work for the company. That's when you go out there. I'm, I'm, I'm just out there working for the company. That's all. I, I work for your dad's company. Same as you guys. You know what? Hey. Shut up. Uh, who was that out there? Who was shooting at us? Who do you think? You don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what? Daddy not like that, is he? No. Now, as you can see, we're completely on our own out here. But I got some great men. We can ride this thing out and survive if we're smart and we're disciplined. It's just a matter of time. So I uh, cleared these bunks out for you. I guess you'll have to decide who shares. Real sorry about that. That's all there is. No more room at the end. There it is! Boys, it's playtime. Let's go. We're both get off your ass. Who wants to play? Come on, boys, get in line, let's go! Who is it today? Give it to me. You? Come on, give it, give it to the man. You, Bobby. Got him. Come to daddy. Come on, give it to the man. Ramon. You're on the gate. Rick, you've earned the honors. Do it proud. <laughs> yeah. Come on! Five. We're doing five. Five! We're doing five! Just figure out how to keep yourself safe from those things and thugs show up. What thugs? Company thugs. Gun thugs. Strike breakers. Seems you got more than one use. But don't worry, they won't come in this far. They just stay up in their chopper, snipe you like the cowards they are. <sighs> there are no gun thugs. No? How'd I get this then? 
Mac? No. No. No! Jesus Christ, what the hell is going on, Rick? Clean it up. Yourself. That's what I'm saying. It's a question you keep asking. You have to ask. What? It's a big question that you ask yourself when you lie awake at night. You whisper to yourself in the dark. When you replay that moment over and over again. When you whack your, your best friend. Ramon? You got something you want to say? Don't be rude. Say it out loud. Out loud so we can all hear it. I'm, got, I'm gonna be quiet. See, Ramon here is having a hard time. Aren't you, Ramon? No, I have not a hard time. Ramon has been driving us crazy with his question. Haven't you, Ramon? Let me be quiet. What is your question, Ramon? I'm gonna be quiet. Come on, spit have, it out. Get it over with so we can all have our ice cream, Ramon. What is your question, Ramon? Huh? What is your question? Huh? Why? Isn't that it, Ramon? Ramon wants to know why. Oh, Ramon! Ah! Yeah. Shut up! Ah! Shut up! Ah! People told me why. Shut up! Shut up! Ah! Shut up! Carter, you tell Ramon why, huh? You know what? You have been too silent since you got here. Why don't you ask him, Ramon? Hmm? Come on, ask him your question. Ramon, ask him. Why? Why is this happening? Good boy, Ramon. Get out of here. I know. I don't know if I could make it through another dinner like that. I don't know what choice we have. We can make it out there by ourselves. I'm not gonna make it in here either. I don't think I need to explain this to you, but I'm the only girl here. And that's a little bit scary. I'll protect you. <laughs> why is that funny? It's not. Why is that funny? Seriously, why is that funny? It's not funny. Are you laughing at me? <laughs>
sorry. Well, well, well. Look who's here. The two lovebirds are finally awake. Won't this be fun? Ladies first? No. This is disgusting. Oh, but please, I insist. I'm not gonna get in the pen. We'll give you a go later. Let me see. Who's it gonna be today? Carter! Yeah! Uh, what about Mac? Maybe he wants to... Oh, come on. It'll be fun. Everybody's doing it. Yeah, quit playing the duck. Turn around, boys. We're not too good. Come on, let's get it. Get from in there. <laughs> All right, let's get that gun. Now, let me think. For Carter, we'll start you off easy. It's two. <laughs> two! We're doing two! Place your bets, ladies! Can we just start with one, please? Now it's three! demonstrated his love for us here today in this way? Ramon, not now. God loved this world so much that he gave his one and only son so that all those who believed in him would not perish. You'll have to excuse Ramon. He hasn't been himself lately. Ramon, go lie down. No, 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 no. Caete tu, hombre. Estoy hablando yo. The apocalypse is now. My friends, are you ready? Let he who has no sin cast the first stone. Ramon, goddammit, I am not kidding you. Cayete! Fat man! Your time is up. My turn to speak now. This is our day for absolution. I will tell you something in God's churches, here, his greatest church of all. We have bragged 
about our perseverance and our faith. But this, this here, this madness, this is evidence that God's judgment is real. Ramon! God is just. One more word, Ramon! And you will punish all those who do not know God and those who disobey the gospel of the Lord. Ramon was a very dangerous man, Rita. I don't want to hear about it. Listen, you just don't understand how things work. Okay, you have no idea what it's like to be responsible for the lives of men. You're a piece of okay, shit. Okay, now listen. Just don't. No, listen, you know what? I've always wanted to know is what is it with you granola girls don't, and these braids? Don't touch me. Huh? Huh? What is it, huh? Or what about down here? Down there? Huh? Don't. What about don't. What's don't. it like down here? Yeah. piece like that all yourself? Huh? You better watch yourself, boy.
was not right. Ha <laughs> ha 